Robertson and I'm Professor of Physical Chemistry in Oxford University. So my journey is quite an unusual one. So I left school early, went as a technician at Pfizer, uh, started working in the mass spectrometry labs and somebody recognised potential in me and encouraged me to do seven years of part-time study, which was a long haul, and then I was delighted to be accepted at Cambridge University to do a PhD. I then did something which was also considered rather unusual, which was to take a career break for eight years, which was a bit unconventional at the time. Really enjoyed that time at home with my three children and then back to Oxford. So I didn't set out for my work to impact society, but I think along the way it has. Um, the discoveries that we made with the mass spectrometer are now influencing drug discovery, so I'm, I'm very proud of that. I think the L'Oreal UNESCO for Women in Science Awards are incredibly important for young women scientists particularly because it gives them something to aspire to. To be a role model for these younger women is a great honour. I think there are perceived challenges for women in science because we have a disappointingly low number of women in science currently. Um, and I think the challenges relate to the fact that it's considered a very macho, um, long hours culture. And I think this is what we have to dispel because I really believe that it's one of the most flexible careers you can have. I never missed anything at school. I was at the school gates quite regularly. I never missed a sports day, a nativity scene, I was there. And I think very few jobs you could do that. And I've thoroughly enjoyed being a scientist. I was delighted to win this award, not just for myself, but really for my team. It really validates the research we've been doing over the last 20 years or so. So really delighted for them. For young women scientists, I think it's very important to follow your passion, to get really involved in your project, to sort of really live that thing. And I think you will find it very consuming. It will become your hobby, it will fill your waking hours, and it can be a very rewarding career.